This video needs no introduction. For a simple narration with credible information. Hi guys, my name is Raymond F. Obede, and you're watching Reblog Media and of course Box Center. Yes, this is a boxing channel and usually I, I rarely cover politics here, sometimes when things are getting worse. But at the same time, you know, like I would say since I was born, I've never in my life support any politician or I have I hopes for Nigerian politicians because I just feel that Nigerian politicians are nothing but crooks and cowards, man. They just sell out. But before I proceed, okay, before I make my claim, let me of course play this clip right here, you know, of a Nigerian politician admitting of rigging elections, helping people, giving catches, and all that, bro. Like Nigerian politics is a deadly is a deadly politics, and this is why this Edo decides 2020 struck me very hard because even my dad when i spoke with my dad yesterday about this election and of course my mom and some friends in in benin city they are all in support of obasaki because they say he stands for the people you know he's been doing a lot of good things and you know trying to um uh bring uh a development to the to the to the to the to the to the, to the state I understand that there's some things that needs to be done still some roles that needs to get done but you don't get it done in four years especially when the your predecessors has already ruined you know uh, uh, i mean the legacy and a lot of things uh that needs to get done over there it's just a little bit crazy politics in nigeria is just is deadly but this right here just hoping the eyes of Edo Light, you know. I'm, I was born in Benin City, grew up there, you know, so I know how it is, and we are very stubborn people. But I wasn't expecting us to deliver the way we deliver. So, congrats to Obaseki for this landslide victory against um, Izayamu. But before we proceed, okay, I write my brother Tajak Bay, all the way from New York. Let's just play this clip right here, and you see how this man admitted of rigging relations and helping people like paying people off and all those stuff let's take a look at it guys let me tell you yes a minute i need to hop the sound so i gotta hop this one so let's just get it because it's very important that we talk about this and yeah yes i did because i'm now confessing the truth I, I, uh, let, let me tell you one thing yes quickly quickly clarify did i hear you say that you helped rig elections before now uh, let, let me tell you one thing yes yes i did because I'm now confessing the truth. I, 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 look, what, what do I mean? I don't have to go and change election. But you know, when you provide money, you give money to INEC boys to help you if they see any chance that they, 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 that they should uh, favor you. You provide money to the security. Any, all our elections in the past, I've been in this game for about 40 years. And I tell you, each time, it's not necessarily when I'm contesting election, but when my party sponsors a candidate. I would like that candidate to win election. And what, what we used to do before, we make provision for INEC, we make provision for security, we make provision for even agents of other parties, you know, so that they will, so that they will not, you know, raise any objection to uh, whatever we are able to get. So whether I, do, I, I, I rig myself or not, by providing those resources, financial, <coughs> Uh, inducement to the officials. I am rigging the election. Do you think that we can diminish or remove that influence as 2019 approaches? I believe so because you see, if people are born again like me and they refuse to do it, if we, the players, the, unless we give before somebody will take, right? So don't give, and then we will not get a take. We will not get a, we will not get a taker. The most why you don't even ask me why am I thinking this way? Look, I am tired 
of being work, of being seen as a criminal in the streets of the world because we are a Nigerian. You know, you assume that everybody is an innocent human being until he, it's, it's proven otherwise. But once you are outside this country with a green passport and they see that you are a Nigerian, even if you are a pastor or you are an imam, they will assume <coughs> that you are criminally minded or you have criminal tendencies just because of where you come from. That must change. I am tired of living in poverty in the midst of plenty. I cannot, even no matter. You heard a guy, you heard this man right here saying that, you know, like those guys, they took action or this guy is coming out right now because it is affecting the, their, 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 their bad leadership, their devilish minded, um, uh, you know, um, my, their devilish mi mindset, you know, is affecting not ordinary Nigerians, but damn, the officials as well. He's saying now, like, oh, he's tired of being viewed as a, view, being viewed as a criminal as uh, whenever, like, when, outside outside Nigeria when they see you with a green passport. Listen, one, one thing about one, one thing about you know the Nigeria, Nigeria reputation over here in in, in the West, like once the westerners see i mean the western officials see or police could be police and immigration officers officers or whatever why they see you hold a nigerian passport they will investigate you time they will they, they will they will conduct a time stand investigation on you compared to uh, someone from Botswana or someone from namibia that just shows that that's why right. this guy you know people always say oh it's some stripes and all that stuff is the government if at least these guys even know that you know and this is why this victory of obaseki was very necessary and is very necessary and it has changed these are remnants of water knocking out uh the in 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 in, 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 in their rematch in a way you know this is a victory for democracy, a, a, fight, a, a victory for anti gofarism you know, a victory for peace. And this victory gives people the power. It gives, I mean, this ha this took place in Edo State, you know, where I'm from. But other parts of Nigeria still needs to adapt to this style of, of, of how things work because they need to know, the people need to know that the power belongs to them, not to the politicians. You know, like that's what matters of most. And Obasaki was not voted there. You know, they didn't vote for him because you know he he, he suicide to be uh, to PDP. No, 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 no. Yeah, the the party has nothing to do with it. It is because of his performance. He won. He won the best governor in Nigeria last year. The best governor award in Nigeria. That should tell you, like, I don't care about politicians and politics or whatever, because I just think Nigerian politicians are the are the most wicked people, are the most devilish minded people in the world. Most devilish minded, most self centered. They are the cause of every calamity that be that befell that country, Nigeria. They are the cause of it. After them come the religious leaders. You know, I don't want to go there yet, but uh, Tajakbe, what's your take on this of uh, this uh, victory of uh, Basaki? Against Isayamo. This is a fight for this is a fight for democracy, a fight against gofarism. The hordes were against this guy, Basaki. All the hordes were against all the people. It shows that when people are really for you, no nothing will stop you. Well what what really uh disappoints me, you know, it's when it comes to politics, it, it, the, the, these things are never are never clean. <laughs> uh, I don't I don't want to say both sides, but we they usually show whoever 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 has the uh, the, the most uh, um, unclean or dirty hands within but within the political game is always the one that's uh, that, that that comes out as you know being. Being the guy who pays for boa, pays for votes, you know, uses the money recklessly, you'll hear you'll hear some. Oh, he co coerced this. He he intimidated 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 this guy. Um, 
possibly, you know, some bad dealings here and there, you know, that's what it is when it comes to when it comes to politics. But when it comes to Nigerian politics, it is just it seems Somebody like it's ten times, ten times is worse. Ten times, you know, the, the fold is just unbearable. You know, I I I I I don't know why they they resort to these kind of things. You know, you claim you want to help out where where you decree, but in, in 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 all naturality, you're not. You're making things worse. <laughs> you 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 seem as the bad guy, and the people you're supposed to be bringing together, you're not bringing them together. You know, you're you're causing a ripple between families. You're causing a ripple between friends. You're causing a ripple between government and bodies and the government bodies. You know, now people are fighting against each other. Now you now there's blood. Uh, on your hands, there's blood on the streets. There's blood everywhere, and now it's it's like a it's like the ripple effect all over again. And then it's like everything is going in circles, and it, it just seems like there is no way to get out of it because these people they don't know how to handle political and how to do these things that are political wise to benefit where they are or to benefit. The, the 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 where they where they um they're, where they're supposed to be leading, and this is what is gonna always bring and draw back um yeah, um wherever they're trying to govern over, especially now that hey, this is going on at Doe State, you know, uh, it's just it's unbelievable. It, it always has to continuously happen. There's not gonna be someone that just breaks the cycle. It's always gonna happen, and that's just the disappointing part of it. It's always going to be disappointing. And you're not setting a good example out of it. Yeah, but one thing you have to understand then right now is that Edo State has become the first state, okay? Edo people has become the first people to take a stance against go for that reason. There's a reason why we, we they, they they call us, I mean, we were called the land of the Seychelles, you know, by the Yoruba monarch uh, around the 13th century or so like that. You know, because where I'm from, Edo has always been is the heartbeat of Nigeria. It's always been a hard land to conquer. You know, even when the British took over, they could not rule it. You know, they could not rule the land. So you have to understand that in this case right now, like that's where the Bini Empire originated from. But one thing i'm proud about right now is that the people stood up and this should be something that all the nigerians adopt but before you continue i'm gonna play this clip right here of this governor obasagi saying that i cannot be a governor and not be a governor you know what he means by that i cannot be a governor and not be a governor let me play right here let me play right here and people will see it this is when he, he really really he, he, was, he got fed up of the situation. That was when he was being targeted by uh, the, the APC or whatever, or Shomala, whatever, you know, the other guys around him. Coming from the Senate, are you aware of We have I've endured so much as a governor. As governor, I've not been able to even dominate somebody for a federal appointment. And meanwhile, federal appointments are made every day. I will sit down, they're coming from the Senate. Are you aware of this? I keep quiet. I cannot be governor and not be governor. <laughs> I should be able to make decisions, and I've made decisions which, in my view, are in the best interest of Edo State. Even within our politics, is it ironic that in a state where we have one party ruling, and that has all the 24 seats in the House of Assembly, we have this kind of a crisis. Embarrassing. Totally embarrassing. And at the center, we have our own person who is supposed to superintend this. So if your children are fighting and you cannot come and say, this, you know, settle them, then what authority do you have to even be a father? If we, even if I was the worst governor in, Edo, in Nigeria, but I am the only governor for my party in the whole of the South South and the South East. Even if I were a madman, will you or whoever it is at the top not protect and cover me? 
Were you the, are you the one that will now come and begin to create disruption at home? No matter how serious our problems are, will you go out of the home, your house and go outside and tell outsiders to come and take over your home? Do you want me as your governor to keep quiet and allow this to happen? No. Should I not fight back? No. That is what you are saying. We should not be afraid. Well, you, you heard it from the guy. He's saying, listen, we need to do better. We need to do better. And I'm really, really like happy that he won. Because for my dad is not a fan of uh, my dad is not a fan of politicians and Nigerian politics. He sees it as he just sees politicians as as uh, as nuisance, as uh, arrogant people, as thieves. But my dad, when I spoke with my dad yesterday, who he voted for, he personally said he he voted for Obaseki. And I asked him what why why do you why, why, I mean you've never been this uh, I mean confident in Nigerian politics. He said. The guy is doing something right. I'm seeing it. Things are changing. You know, things are improving. You know, jobs are going to be created. And he's seeing it. You know, the people are seeing it. They're seeing it. They're, they're feeling it. Not seeing it. You, you, you know, there's something. It's, 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 it's something to see something. But another to feel it. Just like, for example, in the Western world. You feel the change. When it's change, you feel it. Donald Trump became president of America. You felt it. You know, like you always feel it when there's a change in the Western world, right? You will, but in Nigeria, is is not always like that. You can see some, you can see it, like people are building things, and but it doesn't mean those things they are building are gonna be uh, 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 in play or be be be, be, be functionable in the nearest future. You know what I mean? So you see, it's, 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 it's different uh, feeling things and see things. So continue, but before we move right here, uh, I mean, what what was the take? What I mean, the rest of Ni the rest of Nigeria, the rest of thirty five states in Nigeria, the 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 the, the 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 indigenous people of those states and people of those states needs to take a look at what just happened in other state. They need to, they need to copy that. Good governors, if you don't vote for an individual, I uh, don't vote for. Someone because it belongs to your party or belongs to some sort of party or the popular party, vote for the person because he has ideas that will be, you know, that will better your life, you know, or your family life or the environment you live at, your community, and all those stuff. Don't just vote for someone because, oh, this guy's an APC guy, it's a PDV guy, I'm gonna vote for. No, that, is, that did not happen. This guy was, this guy contested as a PDP guy before, he won. And he was, of course, chased out of the party by the, you know, the chairman of APC, uh, Oshimole, you know, frustrated, and he, he had to divert to the other party. And the people still stood by him, regardless of where he, were, where he went to, the people stood by him, because they know that he's doing something right. I just hope this four years that he's got now, impressed because this guy is a is a is a, is a, is a i think it's a prison material it's not a governorship material it's a, it's a prison material it's, his mindset is very different very innovative as well so, but we'll still see we'll have to see in the next four years what he, how he's going to perform if he performs performs like the last time you know what i mean or if he's going to just relax because he has to remember the people put him there and if he doesn't perform in the next four years people are going to talk and say you see uh continue bro um sorry to tell bro yeah, no problem. I'm just gonna end it uh, really quick. That uh, you know, you in, in politics, you don't. Uh, Nigeria is bleeding, right? And you need a surgeon to take care of the problem that is going on within, within, uh, within Nigeria. You know, so. Now that it's now that now that somebody has stood up and done and done something good, it's the question comes to mind: Will he will, will he continue to 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 do what he's doing and, and uplift the people? Yeah, the right way. It's You're right, question. bro. Uh, that's, that's the question is what that's what I'm saying. Yeah. I, I'm, I don't want them to stray stray away from what from from what they've done because I feel like they always stray away from it. I don't know why. 
But that is the question. Can he can he stay on that path and continue doing? It? And that's that's the, I hope I hope I ha I hope I get my answer, man. I need that answer. That's why I'm going to. Well, he has he has already outlined what is the project that is going on, what he's going to do, you know, in the next four years, and how he's going to shape shape how he's going to shape history. So you know, politicians can talk a lot, but some of them don't do it. Now they, they just see if he continue the good work, okay? Because he defeated God for that reason. His main fa he fought the system. He fought top powerful people in Abuja, and he won. Usually, you don't win when you when you go against those people in Abuja. Those guys in Abuja, when you go against them, you don't win because they've got the money. But this election shows that the pe the power belongs to the people, not to individuals. By the way, guys, those of you guys who are watching, you know, like I said, this channel is not a is not a uh, a a, a, pol um, a political channel. It is a boxing channel, but at the same time, me being a Nigerian, a Nigerian, and of course from Edo State as well, seeing how things are unfolded there, my parents are very much involved in this election. They've never been so. My dad. He's so involved in this. He's never been so involved in, in politics before because he doesn't like he doesn't like politicians. They lie a lot, but he's just involved in this guy, and he had to go vote for him. That just shows that this guy's making a change there, and it's nice that he's doing it. I wish we can have more, you know, people like this in Nigeria. But I think as the, the time will come where you know it will. If this if this does not change the political landscape of Nigeria and send a message to those people that call themselves the Godfathers because they have money. Tinubu, for example, has money, you know, he's like, uh, he, he owns, he, owns, he controls Lagos, bro. Lagos, I don't know, he controls Lagos, bro. Like, he, he removed that guy, I think it's somebody also, because that guy did not obey him or so, diverted from his plan. From his plan meaning sharing money. Stop sharing money. You know, when you stop sharing money, they're like, oh, so you don't want to share the treasury of your state. Now we're going to get you out. And they tried it with, it with him now and the people stood by him. Said, Listen, he's doing a good job. So you're not getting, you're not going, any, he's not going anywhere. So it's what it is, guys. Like the video, share, subscribe. As usual, I give you guys nothing but bangers. Well, now, where they watch right now, I beg, when I go follow me for Instagram. Go follow me for Instagram at BoxyBlockSetter. On Twitter at Boxing Blogs and on Facebook at Boxing Blogs. God bless Nigeria. God bless Africa. God bless Edo State. Edo, Edo State. God bless Benin Kingdom. God bless everyone. God bless all Nigerians worldwide. Cheers, guys.